Ever since the ban on 59 Chinese apps in the country, Indian app developers and companies are trying to capitalize on the opportunity by coming up with alternatives. To improve the Indian app ecosystem, the government is promoting the Desi apps through their digital Atmanirbhar Bharat App Innovation Challenge, where they claim to identify best Indian apps and entrepreneurs. Amid the anti-China sentiment, with several new apps being introduced, Vice President Venka and I do launched the Element Super app, which aims to take on rivals like Facebook and WhatsApp. While the app received more than a million downloads in a day on Google Play Store, many users have been unable to register on the app, most commonly due to failure of OTP. Several new apps have been launched in the past few days, claiming to serve as made in Indian alternatives to the Chinese apps. These are some applications that have come as replacement to popular Chinese apps. But are they standard enough to take on rivals? Is the anti-China sentiment just a temporary impulse to the current situation? In the long run, how will they see apps compete with international brands in the market? To understand the situation better, we spoke to app developers and researchers. The initial traction is quite good. Uh, we have seen that. Uh, in fact, uh, if you see the Chingari app, that gaining like uh, 200,000 per hour, right? Uh, and uh, right now, it, I think it's even exceeded that. And uh, in terms of view, views of their videos, it's already crossed, I think, close to a million per hour, right? So in terms of the initial traction is very promising. But uh, the long term focus is very difficult to do at this point of time because right now whatever user behavior is see- we are seeing is uh, driven by some other emotional factors, not exactly the you know features or the you know uh, the other other part of the uh, user experience that they are getting. A very unique opportunity to acquire users, and I think Chingari and Mithon have done really well on that uh, piece of user acquisition. In terms of products, of course, they have a long way to go. The camera is not as good. The field ranking has to improve a lot. So those are the pieces where uh, these products need to get better. Limited trust market. In other words, what that what that means. So you need time to build trust in in market like India. But once you build that, you get a lot of you know uh, uh, in terms of a uh, lot of return. Uh, of that particular investment of building that trust and we have seen in other sector for example you can see a lot of product around a single brand you can call it mahindra you can call it tata you can call it dabar right in smcg sector uh, similarly for app also if you build a trust over time it's likely that if there are more feature people will likely use that and uh, that's the concept of a super app and it's been very successful in china and uh, especially the app like WhatsApp, uh, chat right uh, which is basically a, a social media uh, messaging app applications but then it has inbuilt all the other features like you can book a cab or you can book appointment with the doctors and so on so forth and that can uh, the possibility of happening that in india is very high as compared to any other western countries the true indicator of success is the retention of the product has to improve as more users join the product but right now what is happening is the retention of the product comes down as more users join the product like for example in tiktok as more users join they put up more content as more content comes in it engages even more users but in but like for that loop to kick in the product has to be really good but what is happening right now as more users come in uh, the retention is falling down because the product is not good the current situation is definitely favorable for the indian app developers but long term sustenance is purely based on quality these apps manage to provide for that they need to constantly work on removing the technical impediments and capturing the market of well established brands like facebook the brand that sells through this and maintains consistency will taste success in the long run